Hi guys, today I am going to explain DLLM, lag, lag, lag. Uh, it will help to understand 4G, 5G. So, uh, first of all, we should uh, know the full word DLLM. DLLM uh, stands for Public Land Mobile Network. And how, what is public and uh, why? We use uh, this word in the network because in all over the uh, world uh, dividing uh, their geographical area in some uh, like a country wise in a US in a America in a India so we can how can we uh, identify uniquely uh, which operator in which country so we give him uh, one country have one specific code it's called mobile country code so each country have each unique ID for uh, country MCC MCC so we can identify uh, a country by the country code and second thing it's a if uh, we are using one operator so operator how can uh, identify operator uh, in any one locations like uh, in uh, India suppose so have the geo Airtel and uh, Vodafone so how can identify giving one operator uh, have one unique code this is called mobile network code mobile network so T L M N is equal to addition of both MCC mobile country code plus mobile network code mobile network code so with the PLMN we can uniquely identify uh, with location and operator in the all of the world so it's I think you can uh, get this point about PLMN and uh, why PLMN is needed because you know uh, with the help of PLMN mobile can select your network in the suppose in India and any places have uh, network have uh, all uh, operator like um, Airtel, uh, Airtel, Geo and uh, Vodafone but how can uh, select your uh, your mobile uh, user equipment to Vodafone camp on Vodafone only. Why not camp on uh, yeah, Airtel? Because you know, according to PLMN, because uh, in PLMN, in build in your scene and mobile also radiated every time PLMN. I, I will explain in the next video and relate all video uh, all topic so now what I'm only giving explaining about PLM and what is PLM and so it's a very important because uh, if we have the PLM in your sim and get the uh, user equipment from the sim PLM and and mobile uh, network transmitting continuously PLM and ID so both is matching that's why uh, your user equipment selecting uh, a specific operator only not camping to other it's uh, due to PLM okay and second is lag what is lag rag tag you know uh, we divided now a time in a country only for suppose it's have the uh, one country one country have one uh, PLM for the one operator like uh, Airtel then all over the India uh, geographical area 
is uh, dividing in some small small part and uh, if we are talking in the uh, 2g technology that uh, 2g technology term is used for lag lag is location location area code so it's a location area it's a location area location area it's a dividing uh, a small a small uh, area uh, it's called location area and giving one specific code so it's called the location area code location area code so it's called a location area code and what is a rack so if we if this is defined in only 2g term uh, it's called lag and uh, if when uh, 3g come so in a 3g have a uh, two types of uh, if i do one is the ps ps service and cs service yes ps means packet data for the data and cs means uh, uh, circuit switch for call so if we talking about call like a same location area code giving for one a specific location it's called location area code and for the ps giving one uh, dividing geographical area to find you uh, uniquely in all over the country uh, is called rag r a c rag means yeah routing area code because in uh, in a ps have divided geographical area in a, a small area it's called location uh, sorry uh, routing area routing area and keeping one specific code for the uh, this area is called uh, routing area code so for the ps in 3g uh, rack is used only and uh, in a cs in 3g also same like a 2g using uh, lag and if we talking the tag tag is used for the 4g 4g and suppose in all over a country in any country dividing in a one plmn that means in any one country have one operator suppose i am talking about uh, airtel in india have all over the country dividing one uh, a small a small area a small area this in for 4g for 4g i am talking about 4g so this area is called uh, location area sorry uh, location tracking area in 4g we are term in a tracking area one app tracking area it's called tracking area in all over uh, country dividing so and giving one unique code to identify uniquely uh, to all over the country is called location area code giving one code so location is it's called tag location area code so with the help of location area code lag uh, we can identify where are you calling from so that's why every time uh, operator and anyone uh, with the help of network can detect where are you calling from where are you stay uh, with the help of tracking area code and one uh, last word tracking area id what is it's uh, important because so many interview asking about what is the difference between tag and uh, location area id location area id is used for uh, uniquely identify uh, one places in all over the world then how can uh, what is location area id 
sorry tracking area id in the term of a 4g tracking area id is equal to tracking area code and if we are talking about p11 india a country like suppose india and one operator uh, like uh, uh airtel so giving uh, one plmn 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 okay and if we uh, more dividing what is plmn so tracking area code plus plmn is uh, plus into mobile country code mobile country code plus mobile network code so tracking area uh, is the sum of three things uh, tracking area code and tracking uh, mobile country code and mobile network code it's called tracking area code and tracking area code why are we always asking because uh, with the help of tracking area code we can uh, uniquely identify uh, where are you calling from and uh, at some specific locations we can uh, identify so it's all for today thank you for i will meet in uh, again